of the things you can experience this Saturday at the Aerospace Museum of California. Wendy Aguilar has a preview. Good morning to you, Wendy. Hey, good morning, guys. Well, he was definitely way ahead of his time. There's so many machines in here. Machines in motion. Get that? So this display is on for the summer, and this is your only time that you'll be able to catch it because once it's gone, it'll be gone and gone for good. Now, I'm focusing on this piece right here because Cody might like this and also because it's really important piece, especially this weekend. Now, Roxanne, can you tell us a little bit about it? Well, he was an observer of all things nature, and this is actually designed to measure humidity. So when all your electronics go down there, you can come out here, the cotton gathers the humidity, and then you have a known weight, and they would use like paraffin wax, and then it would measure the humidity here. Isn't that well, something? There you have it. Now, there's a lot of uh, things that you have on display out here, and I'm just fascinated with everything that's out here. Some of my favorite items, though, of course, this is very interactive uh, exhibit going on, but this is probably one of my favorite items out here because you can also come here and get a workout. So I've been working out my arms this morning trying to lift this item here, and all you have to do is this. But imagine you had to actually lift that item without the use of this machine. You'd probably have a really hard time doing that, correct? Yes, and he was looking to do labor saving devices to help mankind and also to move in a different direction from just the manual labor of people doing things, but also using simple machines. Of course, another one that I really liked, and I wanted to use it for something else like winemaking, but you said it was for olives. You want to show us that one? <laughs> it's right over here. So, of course, my mind was already thinking. How can we make wine out of this? Yeah, and you got me all excited there. But, uh, you know, you have to have something with your wine. So olives, an olive oil is big in Italy. And so what you would do is you would put the olives in here, and then this would move around okay. right here, either by man or by even a, a horse or something. And then it'd press the olives, and the olive oil would come out right there. So that sounds delicious. Of course, I thought we can put some grapes in there, too, and make some wine. <laughs> and then, of course, that one right over there is something that looks very familiar to us nowadays, and that's a bicycle right there. Yes, and if you think about it, bicycles use a drive train, a chain drive like this, and this was his uh, design of a bicycle. Now, I don't think it would win an Amgen, but... <laughs> And it doesn't look really comfortable, but if you think of this, if this is the 1500s, this is what he was designing. And, you know, uh, he was quite, had quite an imagination. That is just unbelievable. Now, a lot of stuff happening, especially this weekend. We're talking about Saturday. Something very fascinating is happening. Uh, yes, we are having one of our open cockpit days where we open the aircraft. You can get inside, you can sit in the cockpit or sit okay. in the airplane. And we're hoping that we have a little window of weather. Maybe you guys can work on that. Yes, we'll tell Cody to give us some better yeah, weather Cody, for this on, Saturday. For so uh, coming up on the next hour, we're going to go out there and check it out. Guys, we'll send it back to you. All right. Sounds, Sounds good. good. Thank you. It's going to be a great weekend. Thanks, Wendy.